Hi, Anthony here from Learning to Play the Guitar. In this video, I'm going to show you how to play the tune a little bit off by Five Finger Death Punch. Just a reminder, if you're enjoying this video, please like and subscribe, and you can check out more lessons and my books at my website, learningtoplaytheguitar.net. So first up, before we get into this song, we've got to be aware that the whole guitar is down-tuned to what they would call a drop C tuning. So basically, we have a standard guitar tuning, take it down a whole step, and then drop that six string, the bass string, down another whole tone. So what do we have here? We have a C, G, C, F, A, and a D. So I have this sort of very low D sort of sound if I play a D chord here, but it's actually technically a C chord, but tuned all the way down. So for me, I'm gonna sort of treat it as a normal standard drop D tuning in my head and how I'm notating it on the tab that'll pop up on the screen as well. So what are we doing here? I'm gonna call this first shape here, the E minor shape, so we've got those three strings there, the thumb, index, middle finger on the GB strings. I'm going to call that standard tuning as well, just for my brain, it's much easier. Then we jump to fret five, pick the same string. So bass note, GB strings, index, and middle finger. Next chord is a D related thing. Again, pretending this is D. Bass note, fret four, fret two on the two middle strings. Let's call them DG strings as normal. And then we are going to do like what I would call a chord in my brain, which is basically open string five, fret two, fret two, and there's a little hammer that will happen onto fret three on the second string from the floor down there as well. There's a little thing happening. So the main theme is using those four chords for 90% of the tune, more or less. So in between the chords, there is a muted hit on the strings on beats two and four of the bar, like you would hear in More Than Words by Extreme. Uh, songs are uh, Why Georgia by John Mayer or that Ed Sheeran song Thinking Out Loud. Well, first off we have the E minor chord whack to the G to the D thing and we have the A with a little hammer whack and there's an extra little whack which I'll just do by taking my hand off to mute the two, two or three bottom strings and just give it a pluck with the index and the middle finger. So at speed that sort of sound. There is a variation at the fourth round in the verse, and I think every alternate variation also in the chorus, if you like, where we will go instead of going to the A thing, there's gonna be like a little E minor. Number two, open G, B strings. Of course, these are all again down tuned. So that in context would be. There's also another little riff that happens in a few spots in the tune going back into a verse if you like. So we would have the main theme of those three chords and they have this little, little pentatonic sort of riff there. Uh, two, two, open, two, number five because of the tuning and open the string there, the open on the fifth string there. So. There's a little grace note thing before that because it sounds like an overdub when you first hear it with a guitar pick scraping down with some dead string, but you can sort of do it with the thumb for an effect there. So one more time with that. Then back to the main theme. So that's all the parts really for the song. Fairly simple, but it has a nice sort of vibe going with the down tuning and the little percussive hits.